so it's going to be it's going to be a very interesting show. Uh, it's funny because I'm a comedian. Uh, it's lively and it's um, I, I hate to say educational, but you're going to get a lot out of it, whether you have ADHD or not, because you probably know someone who does. <laughs> ADHD is a really individual disorder. Many of the doctors have told us you've seen one kid with ADHD, you've seen one kid with ADHD. The range of symptoms and the impairment with executive functions and organizing, planning and so on shows up in many different areas of life, every area of life in a way. Your relationships, your work, your um, even just the ability to relax and recharge and what you do for fun which often is dangerous and risky because it gives you, I won't get into it now, but it gives you some chemicals that you're lacking. It's gonna be an interesting event. And whenever I've spoken at universities and I have across Canada and down in the United States as well, you'll see ADHD experts show up. Does a comedian know about it? And they're nodding and they come up afterwards and say, thank you, you, you did a great job. The only thing I might correct is, but you know what, that was actually right. Maybe five, six percent of University students have ADHD. Um, they're struggling with restlessness, poor memory, having to read things three times to get them, uh, being late, managing and organizing themselves, and so on and so on. There's all of these challenges, but they're challenges that every student has, right? Every student could improve their memory. Every student could be better at organizing themselves, at getting up in the morning or getting enough sleep, which is a huge issue with ADHD. Although the event is really about ADHD and my story and the story of my son and the story of many people who have this, who have succeeded at university and also those who have failed. Um, it is really, I think, about how to maximize your brain, how to understand how your brain works, figure out what you do well and what you don't do well. So this is really exciting. Uh, Renison University College at the University of Waterloo, my alma mater, is uh, having an event, and it's October 17th, I think it's 4.30 in the afternoon. Uh, you can get the details online, but I'm gonna be talking about my experience being uh, a student here many years ago, back in the 1700s, uh, with undiagnosed ADHD, and about my son being a student at university with diagnosed ADHD, and the huge difference that made, and all of the strategies, the tools, the accommodations, the tricks, the little tips, the little things you can do to soar with this.